All right, yo, what is good in the hood, everybody? It's your guy, Chai, coming back with you guys for another trip to the thrift video. This is going to be video number six. I'll show you guys my thrift haul at the end of the video. Um, it's the Friday after Christmas, so, you know, it's there might not be a lot of new stuff. If there is, I'll be thankful. If not, then that's going to suck because last time I came uh, on, Black, on Black Friday and I didn't find jack shit, dude. It fucking sucked, bro. Like, I drove around to all my spots and I didn't find anything. So I'm hoping today is not going to be a repeat of that. But, um, yeah, man, I'll try to supply you guys with some in-store footage, and right now I'm about to grub out my breakfast real quick, you know, I got a couple bananas, got a muffin, got my yogurt, got my water, already have my coffee, so I'm good to go. But speaking of breakfast, though, man, did y'all know that two bananas will supply you with enough energy to sustain an intense 90-minute workout? Man, facts, y'all, facts. Get your banana game up. But, yeah, uh, I'm about to eat real quick, and then I'm about to get it in, all right? So I'll see y'all later. Peace! All right, so they got a couple good things today. They got some Nike Freeze here. They're... In pretty good condition, but they're asking 25 bucks for these ones. Um, let's see. There's some other stuff here that I saw a second ago. There's all these. Uh, there's also these Nike Free 3.0s. They're asking 20 bucks for these. Um, got a couple of others. Most of this stuff's been here for a little while now, so it's not really worth picking up in my opinion. But there's also these Nike Freeze here, also 25 bucks. Um, and another pair of Nike Freeze. Look like somebody just dropped off a bunch of Nike Freeze here. These ones. Pretty nice though. These ones are only fifteen dollars. Actually, not that bad, but too big for me, and not really worth copping the resale. But yeah, shoe game, not much. Are you cripping though, cuz? You ain't cripping though, man. Look at this, yo. You ain't cripping though. Come on, cuz. All right, so good one number three. This store's had like the same stuff for a while now. Peep the shoe game. There's a bunch of Team Jordans and stuff like that, but nothing too crazy. All right, just to show you guys a couple of examples. Uh, got these Team Jordans here. I forget what these are called, but these are 15 bucks. Uh, Jordan 19s, 15 bucks. Uh, LeBron Soldiers, Zoom Soldier 7s, I think. These are like super big and I think like 20 bucks. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just hit an employee. <laughs> um, they got these LeBron's uh, twos or something like that. But these are kind of beat too, 15 bucks. Um, Mellows, 20 bucks. Um, another pair of Team J's. Like all these shoes are kind of spendy too, so not even worth it. Jordan's lights, beat. Um, these Iversons are actually pretty cool. I saw these like last week, but they're asking 20 bucks for them, so I had to pass. They're my size too. Um, Nike Flyknit Lunars, nothing special. Um, Jordan 2010s. Another pair of Team Jordans. What else I got here? Got these Jordans, I forget what these are called. Um, let's see what else is there. I know there's a couple others that I saw. Mm. They yes, asked me to just kind of see what I see, I guess. Uh, yeah. But yo, check this out. I just dug this up. If I can get it up in there. Logo 7, Los Angeles Raiders script, crew neck, size large. Really clean, looks almost brand new. It's only 6.99. I'm pretty much done with this store now, so I'm about to go to a different one and see what else they got. All right, so I'm at Google number uh, four. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, I was going to say I'm sorry for uh, if I'm speaking really low or if I'm only sh uh, showing certain things because um, it's because there is not much else to show. So I don't really want to waste my time or your time with, you know, just nonsense or silly stuff. But, yeah, I'm at Google number four. I'm about to go in there and see what they got. But, yo, check out this library, though, man. The public library always cracks, yo. Always, there's always a line, especially in the summertime. Oh my gosh, it's, it's ridiculous. There's so many people there all the time. But yo, like I said, my Google number four, um, it's a little bit smaller, so I may or may not show you guys in store footage with that one. But um, this one usually always comes through with good stuff. So yeah, we'll see what they got. And yeah, so I found some pretty cool Western shirts, and this is one of them that I'm gonna get for sure. It's a Wrangler's cowboy cut. Just a random starter, Boston Bruins. It's pretty beat up, just like I showed you guys. Not gonna get that though. Uh, 
We got this Pendleton short sleeve uh, button up. I'm not gonna get it, it's my size, but the tail's way too long. Another Wrangler, like native print, uh, like rugby shirt, not gonna get it, it's too faded. Um, got another Carmen Western shirt, not gonna get it, too expensive. And there's another Wrangler uh, Western shirt there, but that's too expensive too, so I'm not gonna get it. And then lastly, we have the CCM uh, Washington Capitals women's uh, hockey jersey. Not gonna get it as well, they're asking too much. All right, yo, what's good, everybody? I'm back at the house now, so let me show you guys what I got today and some of the stuff that I picked up over the last few days that I forgot in my last video. So first things first, let's just go and get these like little infant shoes started. These are the Jordan Playoff 8s uh, in the Low Top Series from uh, 2003. These are in really good condition. I picked these up for a freaking steal. Um, then next up, we have these OG 1995 uh, Jordan 10s. Um, these are crib shoes. They're like size 3. Um, yeah, these are pretty cool. So I decided to pick them up for really cheap as well. And then next up we have these like Nike running shoes. They're, um, Nike spiders. I think they're called. Um, I can't really see that. It says Nike. Yeah, it says Nike lunar spider. Like the really only, like the real only downfall. The hell am I saying? The only downfall is just like the dirty midsole and the, the dirty bottoms. Like, as you can see, it says like running in there. And these are samples as well. So hopefully these will be worth a little something. Uh, yeah, I thought these were cool, so I decided to pick those up, and just looks like they just need a little quick cleaning. But yeah, onto the clothing. Um, this thing is from the 80s. It's a Nike sportswear. Uh, as you can see the tag there, it's um, just like a track jacket. It says number four. It's stitched on there. And then on the back, it says Oregon. It's all stitched in as well. This thing's pretty cool. It's from the 80s. Like I said, I just picked up the other item from the 80s um, in my last video, so I thought that was pretty cool. Um, next up, we have this uh, Los Angeles Raiders uh, Logo 7 like script crew neck. It's pretty clean. It looks like it's pretty much brand new. I mean, it's a little bit dirty right there, but, I mean, just throw it in the wash and it'll be good to go. Nothing on the back. And then I picked up this starter, uh, New England Patriots, like, uh, Drew Bledsoe jersey. It's like an MLB, like, baseball style jersey. And I've never seen one like this before, so I thought, I thought that was pretty cool. And it's in really good condition. It's, like, practically brand new. Like, letters are all sewn on. There's no stains or anything like that. And then uh, I picked up this authentic um, University of Miami Hurricanes Nike basketball shorts. These are size XL. Pretty cool, pretty clean, pretty cheap. And then this um, uh, Adidas authentic uh, Minnesota Timberwolves basketball shorts. I just picked these up today for also really cheap as well. And it's missing like the wolf right there. But, I mean, these might be samples. There's usually like a sample tag, but I didn't see one. It says Minnesota right there. Pretty cool. Um, and then I picked up this Western shirt. This thing was so cool, dude. Like, I wish it was my size because if it was, I swear I would wear it. And, like, these Wrangler ones are usually pretty expensive, but this one's, like, practically brand new. And they were, it was only, like, 7 bucks. And this is Cowboy Cut, regular fit, extra long tail, um, 16 to 35. Yeah, this thing is really wild. I've, man, I wish it was my size, honestly. And then last but not least, we have this um, Adidas sample. It's, a, like, a bomber jacket, fight jacket, um, whatever you want to call it. It's an Adidas sample size medium, size 50 or uh, or a medium. Yeah, like I said, what the heck? Bleh. Size medium or a size 50, whichever you want to call it. It's a David Beckham jersey or a jacket. And it's made by uh, or designed by, it says J Band right there. Let me show you guys the tag. Okay, I won't focus too close. But yeah, it is a sample. It's a size medium. I picked this up for pretty pretty good price and it's pretty much in brand new condition there's really no issue wrong with, or no, no nothing wrong with it what am i even saying right now but yeah um that's the end of the video uh, make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and if you guys enjoyed then let me know or if you guys enjoyed what it was like to have in-store footage then let me know and i'll try to provide you guys with some more and until next time, follow me on Instagram. It's at Chigasm, or actually I changed it. It's Rose City Exchange. All my information will be in the description below. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.